Have you ever wondered what truly distinguishes the righteous from the wicked? Today, we delve into the wisdom of the Psalms to uncover this vital distinction. Let us begin by giving all glory and praise to our Heavenly Father, who guides us through His Word, illuminating our paths and strengthening our spirits. His truths stand as a beacon of light in a world often shadowed by confusion. Today, we focus on a profoundly instructive verse from the book of Psalms, chapter 1, verse 1. Blessed is the man who walks not in the counsel of the ungodly, nor stands in the path of sinners, nor sits in the seat of the scornful. This verse serves as the gateway to the entire book of Psalms, setting the stage for a divine discourse on righteousness and wisdom. It begins with a declaration of blessing, blessed or supremely happy and favored by God, is the man who chooses a specific path of life. The psalmist meticulously outlines what this man does not do. He does not walk in the counsel of the ungodly, meaning he does not follow advice or patterns of thinking that contradict God's laws. He does not stand in the way of sinners, implying he avoids lifestyles and behaviors that are against God's commands. Lastly, he does not sit in the seat of the scornful, those who mock or disdain what is holy and righteous. In its essence, this verse contrasts two ways of life, one rooted in the wisdom and fear of the Lord, and the other in rebellion against divine authority. It teaches us that the life of a righteous individual is characterized not just by the good they perform, but profoundly by what they avoid. In today's context, we are constantly surrounded by a cacophony of voices, media, peers, and even leaders offering us counsel that may not align with the wisdom of God. This verse calls us to discern these voices carefully and to choose a path aligned with godliness and truth. The decisions we make about whose advice we follow can profoundly affect our spiritual health and our relationship with God. Let us pray, Heavenly Father, we thank you for your word that lights our way. Give us the wisdom to discern and the strength to avoid the counsel of the ungodly, the path of sinners, and the seat of the scornful. Help us to embody the righteousness that you desire in our lives, that we might be a blessing and a light to those around us. In Jesus' name we pray, amen. Thank you, brothers and sisters. May you go forth in the wisdom and counsel of the Lord, deeply rooted in his word. Until we meet again, may God bless you and keep you guided in his truth.